Hey guys, this is Tom. Welcome back to NASCAR The Game 2015. Um, we're here at Richmond for race 9, I think. Um, we're going to pick it up where we left off from our win at Bristol. Our first one of the season, finally. Um, and now it's on to Richmond. And I'm 18th in points. Uh, I didn't get a sponsor request last episode because uh, I, yeah, I didn't do well the previous races. Um, so we're going to try Richmond. Um, it's a three-quarter track, three-quarter mile track. Um, I'm going to accept the changes. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do qualifying, I'll be right back. Oh yeah, and by the way, I have the American paint scheme, this race. Hey guys, I'm back. I just did qualifying, I start third in this race. Uh, let's take a look. And I missed the pole by three one-hundredths of a second. Yeah. Um... But it's still a good qualifying run, um, and I'm good in a good position to win this thing. Um, just scanning through the qualifying results. Um, so yeah, it should be a night race. Yeah, it's going to be some fun racing over the lights. It's also going to be... The first night race of the season, which is weird, so. Yeah, here we go. Hello, everyone. Mike Joy, Daryl Walker, and Fox Sports welcoming you to tonight's coverage of the Capital City 400 from Richmond. Mike, most of the drivers consider this track to be their favorite. They love racing here. They like the open space you get to have in the corners, kind of get two or three wide. It's fast, but not too fast. Close, yeah, maybe too close. Or that curving front straightaway, that takes its toll. It does, like it wears you out. This race is a lot more physical than it looks like. When they started here in the early 50s, this was a half mile dirt track. Now at three quarters of a mile with a looping front straightaway, many drivers say this is the perfect combination for short track and super speedway. Let's find out. <laughs> Alright, so here we go. 20 laps. At night, we'll see what happens. Yeah, it is a three quarter mile track. Hundred. Oh my goodness. Okay, I got that bonus point for leading a lap. Ah. You're telling me when I have cars. Wow, and I'm out in front. My goodness, they close in the turns and I pull away on the straightaways. <laughs> this isn't a bad track. In fact, people call this the action track. Because so much action happens here.
Okay, we're five laps in the race. Um, we're going for two in a row. Two in a row, isn't that nice? Well, it sure is. Alright. I broke too much there. Gonna have to keep an eye on that. Uh, yeah, water temperature there. Because it got me in Phoenix. Where I would have won the race, but I couldn't do it. Overbroke too much. Or overdrive that corner too much there. the wall. Good thing I saved it, though. About a hundred. Throttle out. Now slow down to 90. Throttle out. About a hundred. Throttle out. This is repetitive, isn't it? The tire wear. Yeah, again, it can get you. So far I'm leading by a second. Okay, seven laps to go. What happens when you overdrive that turn? Yeah. Turn one. Okay. About time I take out the cone. Looks like my engine will be fine. Alright. Alright, three laps to go. And I could be the first back-to-back -back winner in this this Let's Play so far.
Alright. Get around you. Alright, here we go. Final lap at, here at Richmond. Alright, well, there's struggles early on and a win at Bristol. Back to back wins. I win at Richmond. Let's have some fun. Let's do this in the grass. How about this? At least we didn't have rain the previous night. Otherwise the grass would have been wet. And let's do a backwards victory lap. Oh, oh, my engine is overheating. <laughs> Two wins already. And here to celebrate our backwards victory lap. Uh, yeah, that's what we're gonna do whenever we win a race. We're gonna go around the track backwards You don't get to do that during the race do you? <laughs> So let's take a look at the results. I let every lap again, and I'll set the fast lap. So yeah, these are the points. I think that guy, Mac Kenseth, was the point leader coming into this race. Probably gonna change after that. Two wins in the bank already. Now we should be locked into the chase. Well, look at this. We moved up to 16th in points. And look at that. The battle for 10th. Hmm. Yeah, we have a new points leader. Kyle Bush. Alright. And it's all about to get better. We now have a new sponsor wanting to sign us up. All right, we have a new sponsor. Except. So, are we? Sh are you sure you want to reach your research this this item? Yes. There we go. We purchased the plate engine. Um, but anyway guys, I would like to thank all of you guys for watching. Leave a like if, if you enjoyed, and of course, stay subscribed for more. See you guys next time. Peace.